Mikey in chat. <laughs> Hello. Good morning to you, lads. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot yeah. to do that. <laughs> do it. Start over. Yeah, yeah. Can you, can you go back to the transition quick? Okay. Well. Absolutely let's, not. Let's... Oh, what the hell? I've got a I've got a burger sitting right next to me. So can we just get <laughs> yeah, this yeah. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go on go then. So, three, two, one, go. And I, I hope Zook is ready for the timer. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> All right. This is Hotline, and uh, it's a top-down shooty game. If you've never seen it before. Uh, it's real fast, and it's real cool, and that's all I have to say really about it. It's kind of cool. Of course, as I said, I'm joined by Baff and Sajiki. Say hi. Oh, I picked the wrong mask. Nice. I'm, I'm Sajiki. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I'm, I'm also Shaf. Oh, sick. Well, so uh, me and Sajiki haven't run this game at all, but... Uh... That's not true. <laughs> but they're very, <laughs> very knowledgeable about it. So here we're, we're actually we're picking Brandon. We are picking yeah. Brandon. And why and we're picking Brandon because he's got the fastest sneakers in all of the town. <laughs> yeah. He's also, he's the, also the coolest looking. The purple is, is really nice, so I thought why I choose yeah. yeah, how did you know yeah, purple is my favorite color? Me too. How'd right. you know purple's my favorite color? Oh my god. I don't believe it. <laughs> you should <laughs> probably know this about it if we're besties. Yeah, yeah. So uh yeah, so this is this is all levels anyway. If you're, if you're familiar with Hotline Speedrun whatsoever, you probably know because it's the most popular category, but basically what it is, it's a New Game Plus category, so we have all the masks that are at our disposal, basically, which allows us to use Brandon, which is the fastest, obviously. And uh, and yeah, playing all the levels also. We're not allowed to do any level skips. We're not allowed to cheat. So, if you don't like cheating, good. Stay here. <laughs> Sorry, just, Kung really quickly asked in chat uh, what kind of burger I had. It has bacon on it and barbecue sauce, so... <laughs> I just thought it was important. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really hungry. I haven't eaten okay, breakfast. okay, hold on. Someone in chat asked, what are we playing now? So we're playing Hotline Miami. <laughs> what? Are we going to explain it all again? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were going to ask me something, Jack. What's up? Uh, no, I was just saying to you, Chef, that you just, you just go ahead and eat your burger. Don't worry about it. I'm not going to eat my burger. <laughs> no, you... Can we get... Can people press one in chat if I should eat my burger? <laughs> I'm sorry. Please do, and just give like no. give commentary. What? It is. It'll be good. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. So, Jack, can you explain the historical reason why we have to go back and always pick up this phone every time we do a mission? What's what's the what's the fuzz about that? Um, can we get the honest, I don't really know. I don't. I don't know what this game story is. I, okay. I, I recommend okay, I can... uh, looking up a Wikipedia page if you. Oh that. no, that's a lot of ones. Yeah. So, oh. uh, Knife is actually OP in this game. Oh, knife is really OP. <laughs> Do people want you to eat your burger, Chef? <laughs> give, give, the, give the crowd really, what they want. I really you better, don't want to eat that burger. <laughs> um, so yeah, this game this is... This is like peer pressure. Yeah, don't, yeah, don't listen to me, though. You have it if, if you want to. So yeah, this game is... So explain the... It's, yeah, it's, it's, quite, it's quite random, I suppose, for a... For a game like this, you wouldn't really think so, but... Um, yeah, it's, it's random about a lot of things, but not about picking up the phone. You really have yeah. to do that. <laughs> I'm going back to the car at the end of every level also, it was not random. Thank yeah, you. go to car. You do, you do have to go to car. Remember that. It's not true. Sometimes which my burger flag. it's called is also not random. Yeah. But... Uh, okay, nice. so, so one thing, I, you know, I can actually mention some knowledgeable stuff about this game. The enemy, pos the enemy positions and, like, where they route around that's all consistent one of the things that is completely random is or slightly random is the weapons they spawn with yeah so there's so. there's three different weapons usually like guns that enemies can spawn with and uh different ones are you are better for certain situations but uh, yeah usually you can change slightly what you have to do in the level or how you go about it dude oh, oh i'm getting all dizzy calm I'm, down I'm sorry yeah <laughs> Oh, if you don't... It's faster to spin. Yeah, you save every... For one spin, you save a frame, so... It is a there. spin glitch. Oh, it is. <laughs> spin glitch. <laughs> <laughs> it's harder than uh, Star Wars spin glitch, though. Yeah. I Good job tell. going to the car, by the way. Oh, thanks Yeah. Much. I just went to the phone there as well. So if I could get a I've seen not a single go-to-car in chat right now, which is... That's disgraceful. I'm, I'm gonna use reverse psychology here and say it's it's really satisfying. Thank you, guys. Helps me out. Uh... Okay. Noob Salmon, most burgers work to speedrun this game, but you definitely need bacon on it. That's one of the important parts. That's, that's why it's called Brandon Bacon. 
That's actually yeah. his last name. Oh, nice. Oh, that guy isn't dead. Brilliant. I'll pick up a gun. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> oh, you'll see, see Jack do this thing sometimes. You can shoot through glass windows, which is actually pretty cool. You, you don't know about that Wait, in the game, you don't think about it, and then some guy kills you through a glass window and you get really mad. Yeah, yeah the AI That's how I can also what, uh, sorry, see through glass windows, right? Yeah, they can shoot you through them as well, so sometimes they frick you up, you know? Mm. I should have also mentioned the uh, audio that gets really loud there for like a split <laughs> second. <laughs> but yeah. I thought I'd let it fly, just to, you know... Sorry, sorry, I can't understand you anymore, I have this beeping noise in my ear. I'm pretty sure in the ESA run you told people to turn their volume I up. I did not, chef. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't do this. I, I, I think I remember you saying that, chef. After this level, you really on, have man, to go, to go to doctor. <laughs> it, was a long, it was a long time ago, man. Come on. I'll, ch I'll, ch I'll change. Okay. Um, yeah, go to car. We, we, we this run's to pretty car. simple. Just go to car. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, I got those two. So uh, yeah, I forgot to mention actually to uh, anybody really that my game's probably gonna probably gonna crash at some stage during this <laughs> because um, when you're when you're running hotline through an integrated GPU, um, which I'm doing, then oh shit I died, <laughs> which I'm doing, um, the game crashes around like every 25 minutes or so, which means if my run's good I won't crash, but if it isn't good then oh my god I keep running. If it isn't good, then it's gonna be a bad run, and also my game's gonna crash, which just adds on to the bad. So hopefully my run's good, basically. Yeah. yeah so the, the Jack... thing is, sorry. So let me let me no, explain this. The problem is when when the game crashes, he also has to reinstall Windows. Yeah. That yeah. That's the <laughs> biggest thing. <laughs> and he really doesn't want to do that too often. You I've know. I've gotten pretty good at yeah. installing Windows though, because you know it happens quite a lot. Just so just you you, you should see how fast I can install Windows. <laughs> Why didn't you submit that for a hackathon? <laughs> oh, well, I should have actually. Uh, yeah, I was going to mention, so Jack actually uh, usually helps us organize this a lot, but he's in uh, Germany instead of where he normally lives, so he's yeah. only got a laptop with him. And People in Germany him. always have laptops, that's the problem. Yeah, they only, you can only have a laptop in Germany. So I messaged Jack and I was like, hey Jack, do you want to do a run? He was like, I don't know if I can. He was like, maybe I can run Hotline, but I might not be able to do commentary for it. And I said, that's, that's fine, Jack. Oh, so here we are. Thanks for being so understanding. As you can see, it's going really well so far. You're doing perfect. Yeah, this is a really nice run. Um, <laughs> I mean, you've messed, you made a lot of mistakes and that kind of sucks, but <laughs> yeah. if you stopped all those mistakes, it would be the really run, good. The run sucks, but you're doing great, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you may already notice it from just watching, but this game is really, really difficult at times because of the randomness and also, uh, yeah, it's just difficult yeah, overall. Playing it, yeah, playing it normally is hard. It's yeah, it's it's known for being quite a hard game actually. But yeah, the the randomness does not help, especially in a speedrun like where you have certain, obviously certain things you want to do, and sometimes the game says no, you're not allowed to do those things. So, so uh, sorry, go ahead. I was just gonna ask Jack, what made you want to run this game? Just out of curiosity, um, I've never actually asked. Nothing really. <laughs> I just because I used to. <laughs> what a shit answer! Yeah. <laughs> no, I guess the story. <laughs> I guess the story behind it is I don't know. I wait, where's my melee weapon? Hello, hello. Where's my melee weapon? Okay, I guess. <laughs> I guess I'm doing this really slow here. Um, yeah. Basically, I just I watched speedruns for like a really long time and. Uh, I don't know, I just got Hotline Miami uh, in a Steam sale one day and I was like, eh, I'll just pick this. And that's literally it. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah. That's pretty much how I started Mirror's Edge, so... I, I watched GDQ once and I was like, oh, this game looks cool. So, hey, if anyone out there is interested in playing speedrun, just play Hotline Miami. You don't even need a reason, according to Jack. Yeah. You don't even need to learn any strats. There's no strats yes. in this game. <laughs> it's true, but you need a lot of Windows keys, so keep that in mind. Yeah. 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 You don't need strats, you just need to be really good. But that's speaking, easy. Speaking speaking of no strats, there actually is a strat here, I believe, during this boss fight. Okay. Is it go to car? So it, well, there, there's <laughs> that there's that too, obviously. Chef, don't ask stupid questions, please. But, Sorry. Uh, <laughs> no, Explain the strat, please. Um so oh my god. <laughs> I've lost the biker time. So basically if we can get bikers stuck in a wall here, uh, which I'd fail to do then. We can maybe teleport it straight into the elevator because uh, we have to execute biker at the end and if biker is in the wall that means we're also in the wall when executing them that should be low enough maybe. so 
Oh, did we get stuck? Yeah, I think so. Yes, there we go. Okay, cool. So, <clears throat> basically, <laughs> where you teleport there is is wherever you you've last pressed space like spacebar. It's really weird. <laughs> So, so <laughs> when I went into that screen, I pressed spacebar in the elevator. So that that that, that like set my position basically. It's really weird how it works, but that's game maker, isn't it? Yeah, pretty much. For the longest time, we thought that was just completely random, and sometimes you you teleported into uh, <laughs> into the elevator. But no, it must have. You guys must have felt really dumb when you, you figured really it out. Really dumb, like so dumb. <laughs> yeah, because we we always had like these theories about it, like uh, which mask you pick and stuff, like the changes where you get teleported and stuff. But it's literally, <laughs> it's literally as simple as just where you last press I, space. I bet I know what it is. It's the type of burger you order. Oh, of course. <laughs> Wait, which burger did you order? Because you obviously ordered the one that corresponds to uh, the elevator. Yeah, it's called the elevator burger. Oh, nice. <laughs> Makes sense. <laughs> I didn't make sure you crank up the music, by the way. Oh, yeah. Duke, can you get on that, please? Oh, this is bad, actually. Pretty bad pattern for this guy. I don't think Zook has any control over that, actually. Nah, it's okay. I'm driving over to his house. I'll just uh, up the volume Thanks. on his piece. <laughs> but he has me out. Um, so, yeah, push it. Oh, best music, by the way. As G says. Or as GT alludes to. All the music in this game is great. Yeah, if you're not in this track. game, you should still uh, still check out the soundtrack. And while the second game isn't quite as good as this, you should also check out the soundtrack for that game. Because I think the soundtrack's actually better in the second game. To me. Second game, the second game's casually fun, right? Yeah, it is. Would actually. you say that? It, it is, because you don't notice how many glaring issues that it has, but once you play it for any time over 10 hours, then you're like, okay, there's actually, <laughs> there's actually some things like, really wrong with this game. Yeah, listen, don't listen to speedrunners when you ask them their opinions yeah. on games <laughs> that they run. They're too biased. I mean, usually though, if you put hundreds and thousands of hours of, ga of our, uh, gameplay into a game, you, you're you bound to like it at some in some way. Yeah. Hopefully. Yeah, so, uh... Do you like this game, Jack? I do. It's, well, it's, I guess you're it's a love-hate relationship. But okay. I really, I really I was wish say, it you're supposed to say no because it'd be funnier. Oh my god! Please just follow me. See, this is the type of this is the type of shit that you have to deal with in this game. Like, what is that? <laughs> okay. But yeah, <laughs> yeah. Despite despite <laughs> the game being really despite the game being really mean to you like that sometimes. Uh, yes, yeah, I really like it. It's a good game. Yeah, we I see him now. So this is the only level where you don't actually kill everybody to escape. You just have to kill like 10 or 11 enemies in that screen and then do you still swap. go to car though yeah, of course yeah that's yeah okay. that's a given don't worry you were stressing me out i thought we weren't gonna go to car <laughs> dude i said hundreds and thousands of hours kong come on <laughs> <laughs> billions of hours fairly kong has put 100 000 hours into new vegas at this stage, that's right? true yeah yeah that's the kong yeah, Shout he's gonna to run New Vegas new later, by the way. Oh yeah, nice plug. You should you should watch that because that's gonna be Caravan v uh, World Tour. Tour can't talk anymore. <laughs> you nailed it, so did you? I, 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 I did. I did, it did I nail uh, nail it? <clears throat> yes. <laughs> so this is uh, the level called Hot and Heavy. This is the this is kind of the level that me and Jack bond over. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Describes our relationship the best. <laughs> yeah, perfectly actually. Yeah, this is this is actually where the game starts to get kind of hard actually. Um, so... Kind of hard. Yeah, before it was easy. Yeah, before, yeah <laughs> if, if you die before, you just bad. Yeah, <laughs> like this is pretty much actually. Jack had his eyes closed the whole time. Yeah. Uh, okay, this guy's spooky. Oh, please. Oh, wait. Okay, he's gonna follow me down here. I'm gonna have to wait for him. Ooh. There okay, go. nice. Ooh. I, nice yeah, dude. I don't think I had any weapons in there to shoot that. Okay, so that's you know what's really funny, Jack? What's that? I didn't know you could kill the dogs with melee weapons until I watched you play. Really? <laughs> I thought it was impossible because the timing's really tight. Yeah, it is. It's just their hitboxes are really weird for melee. Oh, nay. Uh, Speak it, nay. It's not, not too bad. It'll be worse. Oh, no. Oh, no. So, uh, some of the things Jack isn't mentioning is there are some like crazy IL strats that people will attempt, but in real runs, they're way too hard. Um, yeah. But there are some really, really cool, uh, like, strats that can beat these levels ridiculously fast if everything goes right and the right yeah, weapons are Yeah, it's pretty much just a luck thing in most cases. Like, um, you can be really, you can be really ballsy in this game, but there's certain things that 
make it not really viable for like full game runs usually if you're just grinding. Um, well, I don't know. Can I think of an example? Like like the enemy health, for example. Sometimes uh, enemies take two bullets instead of one, and it's just completely random. So um, you can't be you can't be as precise um, as you might like to be. So sometimes you can take two bullets though, right? Sometimes you, you, yeah, sometimes you can take two bullets too, so that does save you sometimes. Are there, are there any crazy strats that involve you taking one bullet uh, and still think, living? I don't think so, actually. Probably. Okay. I'd imagine so. Yeah, probably, but we don't know. Yeah, yeah exactly. But it is crazy. Uh, people talk about this all the time whenever someone does a run, but I, I can't understate how much Jack makes this game look, e look easy. Yeah. When it's like, it's ridiculously hard. And yeah. like, I didn't even finish the game and I think it took me like 10 hours to get to the point I got. Yeah, that's because you're so, bad though. Yeah, I'm really bad at video games. <laughs> there we go. I was good at, I was good at go to car though. Oh yeah. At least you, you can always bond over that, you know? Like, yeah. <laughs> oh, you speed run Hotline Miami? Well, I went to car before, so... <laughs> So I forgot the it's pattern, like how... uh, that these enemies come out from this van. That's pretty. That's pretty good. That's usually oh, a thing you fun. never you never mess up. So yeah. Also, this game is really messed up. Like, look at look at what's going on right now. This really yeah, murdered that man. Okay, I'm I'm not gonna look. Yeah. <laughs> Please I close can, your eyes. I can censor some things later on, but I can't censor everything. This is a really violent game. Why'd you burn his body? I know. No, why? It's I demand cool. an answer. Oh, uh, well, he was throwing Molotovs at me, man. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> you don't have to burn his body. Okay? <laughs> Call the police. He was burning my body. It looks like the game's running on two times speed when he's playing. Yeah, it really does. Yeah, That's joke's good. on you. He's actually running on two times speed. It's faster. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> yeah, so this is maybe, I don't know, explain the story a little bit here. The hotline is, yeah, it kind of has a bit of a meta story, like... Uh, the, basically the whole that at, until this point in the game that was all just a coma or until after the last boss fight where I teleported into the elevator <laughs> now, we're, now we're awake <laughs> <laughs> well you, that's this that's the secret giveaway that you're in a coma because how else would you teleport in the elevator yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's the only strat in the game so that's how they justify it in the lore <laughs> it is canon the elevator warp is canon actually yeah <laughs> right yeah so this is just like a health section Usually, yeah, but it's really annoying. Yeah, it's it awful. Be, actually, yeah. it's super unfun. <laughs> yeah, it's until actually... you until you know how to do it, yeah. it's the most annoying thing. Yeah. Oh yeah. Plus the uh, plus the controls are like terrible during this. Yeah. So I don't know. Maybe I should don't... maybe I should force close the game now so I can reopen it and start assault because the, the game crashes during assault. That's really bad. Like the hardest okay, yeah, in the game. Should it, I, I do it? Yeah. Yeah. Do it. Right. Okay. Doing it. Don't worry, Zook. This isn't her fault. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> what? You said, don't worry, Zook. I mean, you no, started doing like, robot <laughs> and disappeared. Oh, no. Okay. Rip Jack. Here we go. That was the end of the run, guys. You forced close yeah. the game. <laughs> well done. Okay. Okay, so this run isn't valid anymore because I, I, I'll def forward, but at least I can finish the run now. Yeah, so Assault is really annoying and really bad, but hopefully it goes well. Good luck, Mr. Speedrunner. Thank you so much. Um, Mr. Runner? Yes? You need to go to car. <laughs> I d just give me, a, give me a sec. I'll do it. Um, Mr. Runner? Yeah. Okay, now you got it. <laughs> Thanks. Anything else? So you go, so you go into a police station and you murder all the cops. You murder all the cops because. Because that's the first thing anyone would do if they get out of a coma. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, where's my melee? Need one of those. Hello, oh, there it is. No. Yeah, you need a melee weapon for this next screen. Because we're gonna go all the way around random like this. Random makes this gonna be really easy because obviously you move really fast. If you're doing this screen with like any other mask, it's really annoying. Oh no. <laughs> There's actually a strat you can do is here. There, is there right. any level where you don't use the Brandon mask? Uh, in this run, no. It's, 
just... Oh, wait, I don't think you have, you have, no, you have mentioned what the, the mask even does. Yeah, I did, yeah. Wait, do, you wait, did, do you... Were you gonna talk about the secret ability that you got? Oh, uh, no. I was just wondering if you did. <laughs> the secret ability? No. <laughs> no? <laughs> the very funny secret you ability. <laughs> Do you want to mention the secret ability? <laughs> I don't know it actually. It's secret. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can tell you really. It's, <laughs> it's so funny though. Oh. Okay. <laughs> well, actually, that's all fun. Decent though. I, I didn't. Ex I I said I was in a strat on that screen, and I didn't explain what I did. So I punched the guy through the wall, um, and then talked to him. So usually you have to pick up a set of keys on that level, then. Go open a cell and talk to him, but you can just keep or skip open the keys or open the door. You can skip getting the keys. You can just punch him through the so wall. So remember, yeah, if you're ever trying to talk to your friend in jail, just punch him through the wall, and you don't need the keys. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> so now we're gonna rob a really rich guy or something. Yeah, I'm not really sure what this is to be honest. We're trying to find out who killed our girlfriend, basically. I think I'm actually not sure. So if you that. if you look up the story explanation for this game, I'm pretty sure there's like a four hour Whoa. video. Oh, guys. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Update on the burger, it's getting cold. It's getting real cold. So if Jack doesn't hurry, it's gonna be bad news. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Sean. <laughs> I'm kind of I'm going as fast as I can, alright? Don't, don't be sorry I'll... for the viewers, be sorry for Shaft. Yeah. I'll unwrap it and take a look. Oh, it's looking rough, dude. Actually, it looks it's really good. <laughs> I wish I shouldn't have opened it. <laughs> oh, you won't be able to resist now. Come on, do it. Take a really loud <laughs> bite, like right in front of your mic. If you make it underestimate, I'll take a bite. <laughs> okay. I don't know if I will make it underestimate, actually. Yeah. <laughs> How am I going so far? I don't know. Why is he shooting the dogs? He's got an irrational fear of dogs. So, like, if you don't kill them in the game, they normally just, like, lick your face. And it's distracting, that's the reason it's an issue. Yeah, it's so, uh, so cute. Yeah. These aren't dogs though, these are panthers, don't worry. We're allowed to kill them. I can't finish my burger by the end of the run. I must oh, savor oh, the can. burger. There's still a few minutes left. Oh, you want to savor it? Okay, that makes it. Yeah. This boss fight is ridiculously hard, by the way. Jack makes it look like... Nothing. Just, well, no, we we did it. We did a two player though. Yeah. Oh, if anyone would like to, uh, pardon the the self plug, but if anyone would like to go on my channel and uh, look at my most viewed clip, pretty good. It's, <laughs> yeah. Uh, co op <laughs> taking down that that boss with with Tajiki. and he does a, light, a nice little move at the end. It, it, it's great view, and I would recommend. Oh no, it. dude. Yeah, you. But you stopped the clip before that happened. He spills oh, his ketchup that. everywhere. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. I don't know what happened to that guy. This jerk. It said it was the final chapter, but this actually is not the final chapter. Whoa, dude, you're so far underestimate. What? <laughs> <laughs> does that does that mean I'm overestimate right now? I can't. I can't. No, no, you're, no, you're not. No. Okay. I meant if this was the last level, oh, that would have been right. a really. <laughs> oh, um, yeah, you're right. Can you pet the dogs in Hotline Miami? You can use a knife on them. Yeah, that's kind of like. You can punch them. You're like you can shear their skin. <laughs> you can. You can. Or, I mean, their fur. Their fur. Yeah, you can you can pet them really hard, as you, you can punch them with Tony. So, all right. So yeah, we're playing this biker now. Biker biker biker's whole thing is can pick up weapons, but he has three projectiles that he can use throughout the whole level. So, uh, pretty much. Yeah. So basically, he has a knife, and you can throw a knife three times, and once you use all three, you know, that's that's the, you're, game you're, over. You're done, baby. Yeah, <laughs> but uh, the nice thing about the biker levels is that he his levels are kind of easier because they built the levels knowing that implementation or that limitation they're pretty, exists. Yeah, they're pretty well like well designed levels actually because you have to like kind of choose where you want to throw your like each knife because each knife is quite valuable obviously. Uh, someone in chat mentioned that if you're to the right of that boss who shoots himself in the head at the end, he'll kill you. Yeah, yeah, that's happened a few times actually. <laughs> it's really good. I. I couldn't imagine losing a PB to that. Oh god, yeah. I've never. I don't think I've lost a PB to it, but I know it's definitely happened to me before. So annoying. Oh my god! Jesus Christ, that was. Yeah, that guy's always really scary. The uh, the enemy reaction times like on biker levels are Ooh. absolutely insane. Ooh. That was very scary. 
Go to bike, dude. Go to bike. I'm down. We've stopped going to car, everybody. Bike. Rip car. So. Dude, nice, nice triple exposure. No thanks. <laughs> that was for you. That was so, for you, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Every time I triple exposure, I go to jail, so. Well. Alright. It's <laughs> unfair that there's a double standard here. So, so how important is uh, score? For the speedrun. It's really important. On a scale from 1 to 2. <laughs> you can't finish the game without score. <laughs> without a certain score. You just Why'd get... you kill all those guys? They were running away from yeah, you, Yeah, sorry. It's a bit, yeah, it's a bit gruesome, actually. But if you leave, you can actually leave a knife on the floor. Uh, or you can throw it, like, into a wall. And sometimes they just walk by and nick themselves on it and die. <laughs> quite funny, actually. I say, uh, I didn't explain that, uh... That yeah, I mean, just, just casually... Yeah, just walk through the wall. Like, well... it's fine. <laughs> I mean, you know, it's kind of self-explanatory, I think. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> it doesn't really need any explaining. Time's coming up, by the way, Zook. How am I on the estimate? You're, uh, you're five minutes over estimate. Oh, no. Because, uh... Actually, I don't miss no, dude, oh, I right. changed your estimate to 20 minutes. Oh, what the heck? Well, I killed, <laughs> I killed the developers for the... for the laugh, anyway. And time, there we go. Hey. Oh, I, guess, I guess I do have to take a bite out of this. Yeah. <laughs> Get ready.